Good morning, welcome back to Wabra Farms. Today I'm standing in our begonia section again and I thought that I would share something that I thought was very interesting. So one of our customers came in this last week and she'd explained that she'd gone to Bouchard Gardens and had seen their beautiful begonias. She said the flowers were larger than she'd ever seen before and she had a moment to ask one of the gardeners, what makes your begonia flowers so big? So they had explained to her that on a begonia, there is a male and a female flower. And so on this begonia, there's a male and a female. Now the male is this pretty one here in the middle. And the way that you remember that is like with birds, chickens, whatever it may be, the roosters, the boys are always the prettier ones and the hens kind of blend in. So this here is going to be your female and the ovaries are on the back of this flower. That's what you see here. The male does not have any extra parts on the back. So what you want to do is you wanna go through and you want to pinch out the females and that will cause your plant to produce more blooms because it's not trying to pollinate and set seeds. So you can go through and even on some of these smaller ones, like this right here, distinguish that this here is going to be a male flower, no ovaries on the back of it, and this is going to be your female. So if I pinch these out early, it's going to help this plant um, have bigger and better blooms. So I can also do it like on my non-stop. So as you can see here on this non-stop, this is going to be my female flower, a little single, and she has the ovaries on the back, whereas the male is gonna be this nice big double. So I can go through and pinch these out as I see them forming and increase my flower size on my begonia plants. So this works pretty much with all your begonias. Here's a Maestral series. And same thing, I can look and I've got two blooms right here the male one is gonna be here in the front and the female one is gonna be here with the ovary. So I'm just gonna go through and I can quickly pinch out all of the females and get a nice healthy plant with lots of extra blooms. Thanks so much for watching and happy gardening.